I'm getting ready to go in and do a video of the chickens here since I haven't done one in a while. Um, I haven't had a good chance to because it's usually kind of dark in there when I'm home either in the morning or in the evening. So I think now there might be enough light to get a decent video. Um, here at the doorway I've got this board across and there's some nails sticking out the top of it and that's fox prevention. Um, I've had a, I saw a fox carrying one off so I put that there to try to keep them in or keep the foxes out. Um, the older hens, they go ahead and jump right across it, but uh, the younger ones aren't coming out yet. So, so far it seems to be working. I don't think I've lost any since then. Um, I may have lost as many as 10, maybe less. I can't really tell because I haven't been able to get a good count of them yet. But I'll just slide it out of the way here. And this is the barn basement. Got, have chicken feed in the cans here in the trash cans. Water in the waterer. They're going through about five gallons of water a day now, so I have to keep them supplied with plenty. Kind of messy down here right now. I need to burn some bags and shovel some stuff. This chicken right here in front of me is a dark Cornish. They're the ones that get eaten this fall. The one to its right is a speckled Sussex. They're the ones that have, they're mostly brown, but they have kind of white heads and, and breast. Um, they're egg layers, and they're, they're also really nice looking. They lay a dark, a fairly dark brown egg. Um, the one right there, right there, is a golden laced Wyandotte. Now that's a type I haven't had before, but they're, they're a dark golden gold and black mix so they looked like the dark cornish for a while but they're starting to separate themselves now and they're a really nice looking bird and an egg layer a good egg layer so um let's see that just leaves the americanas to find i don't see any over here I'll go over to the other part of the barn they have free they have full reign of the whole downstairs here so that's why it's hard to get a count of them. They can run around between the different sections and I can't really see them all at one time. Back here are some roosts I put up for them to use, which they don't use most of the time. They're just two befores across, but they don't care for them. They like to just roost on the stanchions here. So they just roost up and down these, up and down these boards. When they get bigger, they may not care to do that anymore. They may move to the two befores, but um, there's an Americana, the light colored bird there. They're the ones that lay the blue or green eggs, the Easter egg chickens they call them. Hopefully I have some of each, hopefully I get some different colors, not just all green. I think green are the most common, but it would be nice if I get some blue ones and sometimes they'll also lay kind of a, a real pink egg. So this is where they have the most of the bedding. It's back here where I expected them to be roosting, but since they don't, the bedding stayed pretty clean so far. But it's still going to need to be swept up one of these days. Back here is actually where at least one chicken likes to lay her eggs. They're pretty skittish, which is one the other reason they're hard to count. They don't just sit. They don't just sit and let you walk right up to them. Of course, I'm usually not talking, which is probably spooking them more too. There's one of the older hens laying an egg, apparently. So I'll leave her in peace to do that. So they're coming on. They don't go outside yet. This sometime in the next week, I want to get a pen outside for them to get out, get some sun and little grass and bugs so they don't eat quite so much feed. And it'd be good for them just to get out and get some other stuff. But for right now, they're they're still pretty content down here. They're probably still, I don't know, maybe six to eight weeks away at least from butchering the meat birds. And the egg layers probably start laying in September. And there's an egg now. There's a 
green egg from the Americana, the, the older one that I have. I just collected the eggs last night, so this is the only the only new one from today so far. So that's about it for now. Um, I'll do another one of these in a while, but right now they're just eating and drinking and growing. And uh, I think they're about to the point where they'd like to get outside, but even if I leave the door open, they don't go out yet. They're just, they come to the door and think about it, but they're still a little, they're still a little wary of actually going out and dealing with predators. Get a lot of hawks flying around here, which I think they're, they're aware of. And a hawk could carry off a bird this size, so they get a little bigger, they'll want to go out. Well, I guess that's it for this time. I'll try to do another one of these in a week or two.